Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to do holographic nails without a holographic nail polish because they tend to get expensive. I'm using this holographic glitter and, I will, and I'll put a link in the down bar below. I will also use a variety of brushes, a gel top coat, another gel top coat. But, and you can also use a foil glue, I will show both methods. Um, beside that I'm going to use a LED lamp and also some practice nails. To start with the gel method, you could apply a base color in the color of your glitter. I'm not going to because I think it affects the result a bit. But if you do that, you do get a overall better coverage. So I'm just going to apply a really thin coat of this gel. I chose this gel because it has a really tacky inhibition layer and that is what you want. I'm also going to cure it just for 30 seconds. You don't want to cure it any longer because um, the inhibition layer may dry up and that's not what you want. You, re you really want a tacky inhibition layer. So now I'm going to take my glitter and I'm just going to dump it on top with a brush. And the key to success, to really get that linear hollow effect, is to first dump it just all over the nail. And then really patting it in, like really make sure it sticks everywhere. And then you gotta brush it off. And I'm just meaning you want to have a really hard bristle brush and brush it completely off and the reason you want to do that is so that all the glitters lay really flat on the nail and when they are all flat you will see that linear effect So now I'm going to apply a top coat. I'm using this top coat specific for all my glitter things with loose glitter because the glitter does stuck on your bristles and you don't want that in any other gel. So that's why I'm only using this gel for glitters. And I'm just going to cure that for another second, <laughs> another 30 seconds. And this is the result. I really like this. It is actually much more hollow in real life, but the camera doesn't pick it up that well. Keep in mind that it is only hollow in direct light and otherwise it will just look gray. So now I'm just going to do the other method, method with foil glue. I don't really like this method because you don't really get that linear hollow, it's just a scattered hollow, but it is an option if you don't have gel. I'm just going to apply a thin coat and you want to wait at least four minutes to let the foil glue really get tacky. If you go too fast, the glitter will just slide right off. So I'm going to do the same as with the gel, first dumping it on, and then really tapping it in and I'm brushing as much as I can but I don't know why but with a foil glue you don't get the linear effect just the scattered and I'm just going to use a normal top coat for this method I'm using first a clear coat which I also save for glitter manicures because again the glitter will get stuck on your bristles and you don't want that in your um, in your normal top coat. So this is the result with a foil glue. I don't think the difference is really good to be seen on camera. But this one was scattered hollow and this is the result with a gel polish. And it really gives you that hollow linear effect. It might not pick up on camera but it is a really linear hollow. I hope you liked it. Thank you for watching. Bye!